Hello there everyone, first of all I would like to welcome you to my channel and second thing is all thumbs up towards you who subscribe and we have over 100 subscribers now thank you thank you thank you very much I'm really pleased and so many subscribers it's really nice that just means that uh, work which I do you do like today I was driving out just came back and I was uh, out on the road as you can see I'm all wet it started to rain three kilometers away from my house so I made it I would like to show you what I did to my Schubert C5 because I, I don't know if you noticed uh, to those who owns the Schubert C5 the top ventilation is uh, making noise I don't know if you noticed what I did when it's closed or sometimes also when it's open uh, it makes rattle noise and sometimes it makes me nervous so I just checked the vent I took off the vent cover and the vent slider when I took it in the hand it was rattling it was making the noise so what I did I took a sticky tape electrical sticky tape I will show you and I sticked it onto the sides small piece just one layer I tried two layers but that would be too much because then the slider would move too hard so I just took uh, one small piece on the left and right side that stopped the, the uh, noise, the rattle noise. I was out today, I tried it out, it really stopped. It's not making any noise now, so that's my tip for you. For all the subscribers, you can have a look. For, <laughs> of course, for everyone who has got a uh, C5 helmet from Schubert. Okay, right. So I just grabbed this electrical tape. You slice small piece here, take it off and stick it onto the slider. Slider, right, here is my Schubert C5, now with my new GoPro 11 Black. Today, second, uh, second ride out. Let's see what's gonna happen, how it's gonna work, this uh, new mic which I bought and also new camera because uh, like I said the DJI Osmo Action 3 I was really disappointed the stream the videos which it made was good really really nice colors and everything stabilization cool. top the buttons are really good as well screen a bit smaller as the GoPros but the touch screen was working really really good here it's bit stiffer you need to push a little bit more on the screen of the GoPro 11 but it's still nice as well uh, I was surprised it's a bit uh, bigger as the Osmo Action 3 but quality wise I would say quality from quality from from uh, the GoPro 11 is better outside the uh, housing and everything it just looks stiffer and better so I was surprised I didn't want to go into GoPro 11 because uh, plenty of uh, you or behind the screens and plenty of us uh, plenty of youtubers and people on the internet were saying uh, or making videos and explaining that all the GoPros are freezing up and so on that's why I choose DJI Osmo Action 3 because it uh, was tested in the minus 20 minus 16 degrees and so on and reliability of uh, not freezing up and not restarting or rebooting the camera not taking out the battery of the camera I had it build quality is not so good as on the GoPro 11 but touch screen was better the menu also I would say better you could uh, easily understand it it was better than the uh, GoPro 11 but I'm just getting used to it so it's good as well I just bought the media mode because of the connectors for microphone which it has here and I, did, I made second video today I haven't had time to process it on the computer or on my MacBook but uh, I will do it today we will check the picture quality as well but today what I wanted to do I wanted to take off top vent this vent cover yeah First time it goes really hard, but second time it goes easy. Place this slider has 
made a noise and when I was driving I could hear it inside the helmet. So what I did, you just have to gonna put it like this. You just have to pull it towards you. Yeah? You pull the whole thing towards you and then up. So just pull it towards and up and that's it. Then you have separated the cover. Here you have the thingy which slides, but that's something what we don't need. What you need, uh, you can just check here if it's dirty or not. When you slide it up manually, yeah, you can see those two holes and uh, you can wipe everything up. Uh, clean these holes with, uh, with vacuum cleaner. That's what I did because there were small flies inside on the mesh. Uh, that was good. So what I did, you have this slider and when you slide the slider up and down, this is the place yeah, where I sticked the, the black sticky tape. So you stick one small piece here, one small piece here and that's it. The slider slides still easily, but it's not making any noise. Before when I was tapping it, it was uh, making this this small noise. So that's all afterwards, that's all gone. And no more stress. Enjoy. Like I said, subscribe. All thumbs up. And see you somewhere on the road.